Hej. Uh, Nå, no, snak igen. Yeah, yeah. What's up guys, uh, my name is Abias. Um, I'm currently a chemical engineer and undergraduate at University of Manchester. And next year, uh, I've got an internship at BMW lined up. So, uh, the application process was a uh, couple of stages. First stage was, you know, initially you apply CV and you write up um, a covering letter as well. And the second stage is the telephone interview, the third one being the video interview. And those are the stages and at the end uh, you get told um, you, if you're successful and sometimes you get uh, put in the waiting list too. Right, I think uh, it's really important for uh, engineers to actually really put themselves out there and get these internships because really when you think about being employable, companies want to know that whatever you've learned, whatever you've you know uh, got from a degree, that's all good, academic side. Good that you can have those qualifications and they know that you know the knowledge. But you getting an internship is actually proving that you know what you know and it can actually make a difference. Um, some of my tips uh, for, for success for an interview. Uh, tip number one, uh, I'd say be consistent. Um, really, it's a really lengthy process. You have to apply to many companies. The competition is on all time high. Um, tip number two, uh, I'd say is prepare. Um, just literally put yourself out there in the position that that you're always uh, you're always having an edge over like your competition because um, it's a lot of competition right now as it is. So really, what I'd say is. Um, go out there, look at seminars, look at different uh, uh, research that people are doing, really find out what's actually going on in your field. So uh, tip number three uh, is something to do, I'd say, with the covering letter and actually you writing up your answer to their questions. So um, with a covering letter, you really don't want to be that, that, that letter which is literally boring. It's literally him saying, you know, a person saying, him or her saying, I'm this, I'm that, interest there, passion there. Really what you want to do is do your research into the company and really look at what they do and why you think that would actually be helpful for you to, uh, to, to work with in the future and what really stimulates you. And in those words, is actually a way for you to prove your passion. So instead of you saying, I'm interested, I'm passionate, prove it. Research and put that into your letter and that already proves it for them. So that would be my third tip. My name is Abias and I'm part of the Student Inspire Network. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and share and click here for the Student Inspire Network YouTube channel. Click here to see last week's video and don't forget to comment down below.